is Samantha from our RI3D Redux, um, and today we're going to be ramming into cubes with um, one at one, two, three, and four meters per second, and with a underinflated two spec and almost overinflated cube. Something to keep in mind is we can control the speed of the robot. Uh, we can't control the torque, so we will be ramming into it but letting off, so we um, are in coast mode. So it is just the speed affecting the cube and not our motor still torquing it. This video on First Updates Now is made possible by viewers like you and also the following sponsors. At Kettering University, over 30% of the student population was in high school robotics. These same students have received a portion of over $7 million in scholarships. Scholarship applications for FIRST students are now available. Get more information at kettering.edu slash FIRST. SOLIDWORKS is free for FIRST teams. Over 80% of U.S. engineering schools and 370,000 plus companies use SOLIDWORKS to design great products. SOLIDWORKS can help you design a great robot on desktop or on the cloud. Go to SOLIDWORKS.com slash FIRST to register your team. All right, so this is our mid-spec cube at one meter per second. This is our top of spec at one meter per second. This is our under-inflated at one meter per second. All right, mid-spec at two meters per second. All right, top of spec at two meters per second. All right, under spec at two meters per second. All right, mid-spec cube at three meters per second. Under spec at three meters per second. Please note, we do not have any drivers. Oh, so Tyler should give the uh, give Tyler the controller. Under spec at three meters per second. Top of spec at three meters per second. Mid spec at four meters per second. Under spec at four meters per second. Top of spec at four meters per second. So we are hurting a cube with our bumpers at four meters per second. All right, we are trying to herd a cube without bumpers now at four meters per second. A top of spec cube at four meters per second. That went totally around this. Um, so conclusion, don't have things protruding like that. Thanks for watching. Be sure to check out the other RI3D Redux videos on First Updates Now's YouTube channel. This video on First Updates Now is made possible by viewers like you and also the following sponsors. At Kettering University, over 30% of the student population was in high school robotics. These same students have received a portion of over $7 million in scholarships. Scholarship applications for FIRST students are now available. Get more information at kettering.edu slash FIRST. This is free for FIRST teams. Over 80% of U.S. engineering schools and 370,000 plus companies use SOLIDWORKS to design great products. SOLIDWORKS can help you design a great robot on desktop or on the cloud. Go to SOLIDWORKS.com slash FIRST to register your team. Thank you to all of our suppliers and sponsors for the Robot in 3 Days Redux and Kettering Bulldogs programs.